Hello. Can I get two of the five dollar meal things? Um, one McChicken, one McDouble, and no pickles on the McDouble. <clears throat> Um, Diet Dr. Pepper. And then can I get a Big Mac? Yeah, no, just a Big Mac. Yeah. Uh, can I get a filet of fish too? Just a sandwich. Um, sauce, can I get, um, barbecue and sweet and sour? And can I get extra, um, sweet and sour? That's it. <laughs> Damn, dude. That, that that entire menu basically ordered. One McDouble, one McChicken, one Big Mac, one filet of fish 10-piece nugget, two small Dr. Diet Dr. Peppers, and two small fry. Just for your mouth? Just for you? Can somebody do the math real quick on all that? I know the Big Mac is around 500 calories. I think the filet of fish is probably around 300, I think. And I think the McDouble is about 300 too. McChicken is probably around 300. I know two small fries are going to run you at least 500 calories. Uh, 10 piece, I think it's like 500, right? So off the top of my head, 3, 6, uh, 11, 14, 14, 19, and the two smalls, about 2,000. I would say about, uh, roughly speaking, I probably think this is about 2,000 calories. 2,000 calories for this order just alone, and I know she's going to body slam that shit. I literally saw a video of her eating 20 tacos in her car while her boyfriend was chilling, just waiting for his turn to eat whatever residue was left because she thought it was funny to eat in front of him and say, like, oh, you ain't getting none of this. It's all me. This is all me. My mouth is going to be satisfied, not yours, and he was just sitting there looking malnourished just fucking the, in the brain, but this woman just does this shit on a daily basis, man. If you ever look on her TikTok for more than 10 seconds, you're going to be, you're going to be gasping. You're going to be looking at that and going, because she eats so much, so frequently, man. And it's, uh, you know, I know she thinks it's all fun and games. How I order McDonald's at 500 pounds is crazy. Some Big Mac Buffalo shit, ultimate Big Mac shit right here, dude. Uh, Omega level threat to the, to the, to the next degree. And, uh, you know, it, it, she thinks it's funny. She does. But she's getting a lot of views from it, obviously. This stuff on TikTok is super, super, super pushed. I, don't, I just don't understand it personally. A lot of people love it. A lot of people love watching big women eat a lot of food, man. I, I think there's some kind of like novelty to it. Just see like a small girl turn into a big Goliath of a person. And they, a lot of people love it. It's, 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 it. I don't know why, personally. I don't like it. But a lot of people do. Um, I guess it's, it's just it's something beautiful about seeing a 500 pounds. And a lot of people will sit there and go, I don't think she's 500 pounds. She's tall. She's tall. I wouldn't be surprised if she was like 5'10", 5 5'11". 5 and uh, if she was 500 pounds, yeah, that makes a lot of sense for somebody of her size. She thinks it's funny, dude. Yeah. She thinks she's real funny with that filter on her fucking face. That's it. That's it. As if, like, that's not a lot. How I order cheese... How I order a cheesecake factory at 500 pounds. Mac and cheese burger. Never heard of that. Never heard of that. What I love about America is we just kind of throw things on top of burgers as if it's supposed to be there, but it's not supposed to be there. Mac and cheese burger sounds absolutely insane. I kind of, I can kind of see it a little bit. You remember when, I think it was, was it Pizza Hut? I think it was Pizza Hut that for one point in time, they made the menu. They had a burger, a burger pizza. So like a pizza, but the, the crust was burgers. So you could like take off a piece of the pizza and then you could eat the pizza itself, and then you'd be left with the burger as a crust. Which, I never really understood why some people hate the crust. When you go over to somebody's house and they just leave the crust in the box as if anybody's going to eat it. I thought the crust was, crust is probably one of my favorite parts of the pizza. It's like, it's not as good naturally, but it's still okay. It's not bad. I would say if the pizza was a 10, the crust would be like an 8. Or like maybe a 7, depending on who made the pizza. I don't never think it was bad, but a lot of people hate it. A lot of people despise the crust. I could never know. I love the crust, man. Not like that, though. Not the crustiness. Um, you know, if, if your girl got a yeast infection or your dude don't be washing his meat wagon. But I know, personally, I love the crust. But mac and cheese burger. Love America. BBQ bacon burger. Two burgers. That's kind of that's, that's insane. Two burgers is actually incredible. Buffalo Blast. Not sure what that is. I'm guessing it's a drink. Parm. 
herb chicken with mashed potatoes. I'm guessing that's the main. Damn. Um, damn, dude. How many mains is that? One, two, three mains. Mashed potatoes, sweet potato fries, cheeseburger egg roll. Cheeseburger egg roll. I've never heard of a cheeseburger egg roll before. Uh, that's got to be something new, bro. Uh, <laughs> why? Why Why? Why do we even do this? Um, one second. Now, hold up. Let me just write down this on a list. Um, can I get the um, cheeseburger um, egg roll? Crazy. Please. And the mac and cheese burger. Please. Jesus um, Christ. What is this is audio? It? Oh, I see why she might be adding the please in there because a lot of people will critique her because a lot of people in the comments actually be like, damn, you ordering all that food, you talking all this shit about these fast food employees, got them slaving away, having, you know, write down literally uh, a scroll worth of food and you over here not even saying like please at the end of the food. That's crazy as hell. And I can kind of see it a little bit. I mean, yeah, but so she got to add it in. Barbecue burger and for the fries, do you guys put it with um? Can I get sweet potato fries instead of regular? Okay, thank you. And then can I get the um buffalo blasters? Buffalo Damn. Blast Jesus. With fries. Please. And that's it for now. And then. What do you mean for now? As if that wasn't a lot. You talk about for now. Oh yeah, I forgot. Uh, yeah, him. Yeah, my boyfriend. Yeah, the 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 man. Yeah, the, my boyfriend, the guy that's sitting across the table recording me ordering this big back buffalo ass shit. Yeah, he. I guess he could probably get something too. Um, he can probably lick a plate. Bring him over a plate. Uh, I mean, he'll clean it. He'll clean it. Bring him over a plate. Get a toothbrush. He'll clean that shit. He'll maybe lick the residue off my belly button when I'm done. Damn, bro. A frozen mango drink. Jesus Christ, man. Um, I'm gonna do this. Okay. Just pointing at the at the actual like picture on the menu is actually incredible. Um, cheesy and um scramble. You said over easy? Cheesy scramble. Oh, scramble with cheese. Yeah. Okay. Damn. What is that called? The stick mushroom? That's some real big bag shit. It's just not even on the menu she ordering that shit. Okay. Uh, that waitress kind of sound like she had enough, bro. She sound like she's already heated. I also want the chicken and waffles. Okay. I also want the French toast, strawberry French toast. Full order? Uh, yeah. Strawberry Damn. Banana? This, no banana. Just okay. Banana. Mm. Um. Damn, why are you still looking through this shit like that, bro? It's not a gallery. Why you already ordered like three different meals? Is that not enough? What, does your boyfriend get anything? Does he get to order at all? This doesn't come with pancakes. Yes. How many? Three? Two. Two. Yeah. Dude, that, nah, bro. I would have a problem with the waiter, bro. The waiter kind of sound like an asshole right now. I know that there might be some people saying like, oh, come on, dude, you have to deal with a lot of shit. I get it, dude. But you shouldn't be in this line of work if you're going to act like this particular way, dude. Um, I'm, si I'm sensing the hostility. Now, granted, this woman is ordering a lot of food right now. And I do understand, like, it's a lot to write down and stuff like that. But why the fuck you? Why the fuck are you here at this job? If you're going to act like that, bro, you knew people were going to come in here big backed as hell, ordering tons and tons of food. Why are you coming here with a bad attitude, man? I just don't, I don't appreciate that, dude. The way she's acting. I know, like, a lot of people may not be picking up on it. I can smell it. I can, I can, I'm picking up what she's putting down. She's acting like an absolute asshole right now. I can, I can hear it in the, the way that she's pronouncing these words, her mannerisms, dude. I don't like it. I don't like her, bro. She she acting real unflavorful right now. I don't like that shit. This and it sucks too because when I watch this woman, I want to feel like I'm heated at this woman. I don't want to feel heated from an outside source. Yes. How many? Three. Two. Two. Can you add one more pancake if you can? <laughs> mm, that's it for me. Um, can I get the sharp banana for toast? Cheese Grandma, cheesy grits, please. Of course you can. Kinda crazy, bro. Kinda that's some real big back shit, dude. I'm not even gonna play with you. How I eat at a buffet, 500 pounds, 10 plates in total. My two plate at a time method. Fire. What you mean? You got strats? You got strats on how you eat a at a buffet? 
What, what even is that? What do you talk about? I've heard of people going like, yo, here's a speed run strat. Here's how we like beat this level really, really quickly. Here's my strategy on getting, uh, you know, less money. I was, here's my strategy, strategy on getting deductions at, at, you know, like Walmart or something like that with these coupons. I've never heard somebody say, I got a strategy. I got a method to getting more food at a buffet. It's a buffet, bro. What you talking about? Where do you think the food's going to go? It's, it's supposed to be for your mouth. Ah, damn, she really do got the two plates. That's crazy as hell. Big backed as fuck. Damn. Yeah. Kind of going overboard a little bit. Two plates is kind of crazy. Look at that black guy back there. <laughs> God damn, that girl eat a lot. <laughs> That wasn't racist, okay? That's the way he sounded. Do you not hear the way he sounded? <laughs> Damn, man, that's so fast. Ooh. <laughs> Bro, that's kind of crazy, dude. Having a two plates like that? Ten plates in total is crazy, bro. She really went up here five different times to get that t the two plates fulfilled, man. That's crazy. That bag, that bag slay. Oh, fuck down. She about to beat that, that purse over grandma's head. Nah, you ain't gonna start the video throwing on your wig like that, bro. Come on, man. Don't be doing me like that, dude. It's not even a... Giving wigs a bad name, too. I see a lot of people hating on wigs. I know a lot of dudes that specifically tell me, like, No, my girl need to have natural hair. My, my girl can't wear bonnets. My girl could wear, you know, this and that. And I always think, bro, shut up. You know what I'm talking about, dude? Like, y y there's a reason why your girl got to wear a wig. There's a reason why your girl got to wear a bonnet. It's because her hair is got to grow. She don't have the room to grow. She got to wear a wig. She got to wear a bonnet in order to ensure that the style um, protects the hair underneath. So I see a lot of people nowadays hating on women that wear wigs and stuff like that. But if you're just going to throw a wig on your head like this, bro, and no effort at all, bro, and just toss it on your head like that, dude, um, you might as well just go on Amazon and just type in George Washington and just get one of those. Just get that George Washington ass shit, dude. Just have that white, curly, locked head shit. Throw it on the top of your head. It's the same thing. At least you got the novelty of having the George Washington. How I eat at 500 pounds, the best and only way, 80,000 calories this week for 80,000 subscribers. 80,000 calories a week. Just for the just for the record, um, if she's a woman and I'm, I'm a, if she's an average woman, an average woman needs about 2,000 calories a, a day. So at the end of the week, that would be 1,400 calories, 1,400 calories for the entire week. Given the fact that she's eating 80,000 calories, that is substantially more. What is that in terms of how much more is that? That's 60. 66,000 more calories. <laughs> 66,000 more calories. What is that an additional like 3 weeks? In 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 only 1 week? Hey, bro. I mean, some people celebrate in certain ways, bro. That'd be like me going, "I'm going to celebrate my 10k special by sucking 10,000 dicks." Like it's just like, who, "Who asked? Who asked for that? Who the fuck ever said, "Yo, we really need to see you for 80,000. We need to see you eat 80,000 calories." That's I don't know who who said that. Was that just you? Was that was are you the only person setting these challenges up? Who the fuck asked for eighty thousand calories in your mouth in a week? Who wanted that? Let's get started. Um, this is a, you have to have this. It's literally a necessity. Like if you're eating your cereal, you ain't gonna make it, dude. Even if this was a joke, it, it just it just seems like this is too far. It's just too much, man. Even if this, even if this was like, oh, I'm just playing around or whatever, and she does eat it, is the funny thing. So it's not even like a joke. She's actually committed to this. So disgusting. I'm so many levels. So you definitely need ice because who wants hot cereal? That's more than disgusting. Yo. Fruity Pebbles. I'll fuck with food. I fuck with Fruity Pebbles. I do. Um, the Fr the Flintstone brand, I feel like Flintstones is literally on life support right now. Uh, most people don't even know what the Flintstones are, with the exception of literally the cereal, the gummies. Look, marshmallow, fruity pebbles. Oh, no. Fruity pebbles. 
I've never been so insane in my whole life. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, this one's a big one, so it should have asked me two bowls. Two bowls, huh? Damn. So, one today and one for tomorrow. It's a lot, though. Okay. Oh, I know. You guys can tell. I'm so excited, bro. Oh, wait. I needed some for two bowls. Damn, bro. This is like a half a bowl, bro. What are your serving sizes? Half a bowl? Why are you literally 90 degree angle to bag then if you were talking about some I need to save this for later? What you talking about? You literally 90 that shit. Oh. I thought they would be y'all. Look what I got. Nah, you jokes, bro. Shut the fuck up. You ain't doing this, dude. Ain't no way you out here body. Look at this fucking face. Look at this obesity you're looking at right now, dude. This is death. This is absolute like this is this is right here. This is somebody literally dying. And you're looking at this. Strawberry milk? What's wrong with the regular milk? We got to do something about this. This is not funny. This is not, this is not funny, bro. You can't just be pulling out strawberry milk for the, for the, for the fruity pebbles, bro. Strawberry milk? How many, why do we need to add more calories in like this? Strawberry syrup and the strawberry milk. Double strawberry. Double strawberry. I'm so excited. I, okay, let me just. It's already damn. Oh, I hope I have enough for another bowl. Oh my gosh. Okay, y'all. So that's gonna be a half a bowl for tomorrow because. Half a bowl. Damn, that spoon is big. I'm gonna cry. I'm never this is what we doing with our lives right now. Oh my god. Damn, man. Mm. I promise there are better things you can spend Holy money on. Shit. Holy shit. Some mm. big back divinity shit. It's like the god of the big backs. Wow. What do you mean wow? It's just fruity pebbles with, with strawberry milk. I can get better than this. I nothing can be better than this. Nah, dude, this is crazy. Mm. This is on some different level of shit. I don't advocate for any of this, by the way. I know we're watching it right now, but this is actually terrible. This is actually like on a different level of bad. Uh, maybe she doesn't realize the amount of damage she's doing to her body right now, but this is some omega level disgusting shit. I don't want, I don't like watching people eat food, but it's such an anomalistic thing to see these people at this size doing this particular type of activity. And the only reason why they're doing this is because they know that people want to watch it. Like it's, it's literally like you're a straight dude, right? And you're getting paid five thousand dollars to have sex with somebody in porn right and it's like oh i'm making so much money and then they go listen bro listen you're doing well you're doing real well right now with these women and you you know you you big meated it's cool you piping crazy um you got skills or whatever but listen if this dude come in right we're gonna pay you triple 15 stacks right now if that dude suckling suck attaches your shit what you going to do? You going to think about it. You going to go, 15? 15? Just now? Just That's all I got to do is just slide it in his mouth? That's all I got to do? I mean, 15? I mean, it's not gay. It's not gay. I mean, I'm getting sucked off, right? Do I have to look at him? No. I mean, yeah. Yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, I'll go ahead. Bring him in. He'll, he can suck my shit up a little bit, I guess. Yeah, I'm worried about my meat right now. I mean, I'm not even, I'm not going to be erect for the man. I'm going to be erect for the money, right? I'm not going to be bricked up for the dude I'm looking at right now. I'm being bricked up for the cash money, for the stacks. And then the following week to go, listen, man, you remember that one thing you did last week? Listen, that shit was going crazy. We think we could probably pay you 25 right now, 25 if you pipe this dude down anally and you could just do a real quick a quick 30 minute segment pipe that dude down real quick 35 and then they just you know what i'm talking about slowly but surely eventually you're gay you're gay that's how it happens that's how that's that's how it happens man and it's not the same if you're a woman women just kind of eat each other out recreationally like whatever but dudes like it's different it is different. There is a certain amount of meat that you can consume before you before it's too late. Like the point of no return. After about three penises in your mouth, you're gay. Um, and there are circumstances that make it a little bit more, but about three, it's over. It's GG. You have point the you have hit the point of no return. But it's like the same thing here. Like 
maybe you didn't want to do this at first, but then you saw that it was getting good reception. And then people were like, damn, this is crazy. You really out here body slamming food like this? Like, I love watching you body slam food. This is so crazy, right? And then you're like, damn, I might as well just start doing this shit. I might as well. You know, I gotta, I'm, just, I'm just gonna start like recording myself body washing copious amounts of food because I'm getting a lot of money. I'm getting a lot of views. I'm clouded up. I mean, yeah, I'm gaining weight, but like, so what? It's not that big of a deal. It's the same thing. Big back, big back, big back, big back. What is the sugar consumption on this just one bowl? Can somebody do the math? She ate about, I would say 60 to 70% of the bag and plus the milk and plus the syrup and plus, I guess like, you know, maybe whatever she's going to eat after this, but just this, what do you guys, how many calories is this? What's the brand? <laughs> Kellogg? You're not really tasting shit. It's just sugar. It's just sugar. Damn. Mm. That's come on, man. We need to. We Please need to stop. Really mm. Oh my god! It's like flying yeah, yeah. through her hair, man. That wig is fucking busted. Oh my good damn! Why you have to do that? Why are you making that face when you speed running your life? Oh my gosh, she's cleaning that shit. She's cleaning that shit. Damn! Little snack. I've been wanting this before so dinner at five hundred pounds. Mm. That's a snack? Mm. Mm, 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 mm. You is that little Debbie's? You got the little Debbie's underneath that shit too? This is the room. I got this as a snack. I'm about to make some <clears throat> chicken for dinner. What, what am I've been craving this all day. Bro, that's at least three servings, bro. Is that mm. on a pizza box? Mm. I made him stop and get it. After we left Cold Stone. What you mean you made him stop and get it? Like, does he not give a fuck? Like, why Why is he doing this for you? He sees you body slamming his food on a daily basis. He just doesn't care? Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm -mm. That's about three. I just got this as a snack. He's not going to make dinner. Something light, right? Just something hold you over. Just 10, 15 minutes hold you Better. over. Than what I ever imagined. Something light, you know? Something Glistening. a little bit light. Damn. Juicy. It's rice. Mm. It's just cuisine right here. It's just light, this like. A regular Chinese spot. It's called Chinese cuisine. Cuisine. Mm. Damn. A piece of egg. Look at that big old egg. Mm. Wow. I'm the inverted of of bricked up. Like I, it's the reverse, bro. This is just this is just literally disgusting. Everything about this is just fermented, uh, diabolical, absolutely cringe to the next level. And the fact that this woman's doing it on a daily basis, man, like feel bad for yourself, man. Feel fucking bad for yourself. Mmm, I think this is the best rice I've ever tasted. It's just rice. Besides my rice, of course. Mm. Her rice is the best rice. No rice could be better. But I guess it doesn't, does it even matter? Like you're just eating for quantity at this point. The quality of it doesn't even matter. Like when you was body slamming those Rice Krispies, whatever the fuck that shit was, right? You didn't really care about the flavor. It was just more so about whatever's in your mouth. Damn. There's like three servings there for people. Or maybe even more. Do not approve. Disgusting. Feel bad for yourself. My hunger, a little bit. A little bit? Where I can cook dinner. What you mean a little bit? That's a big ass serving of rice. 
Tom Bossom, yeah, I just got this as a snack. I guess it curved a bit a little bit. Like, I was hungry, but now I'm, like, a little bit more. I'm a little less hungry, I guess. Um, not too much, but I'm still, I'm feeling a little something way now. Why you guys smack your mouth like that? Smack it in my fucking ear. Get that shit out my fucking ear! If I'm hungry, I keep munching. If you want dinner cooked, you gotta buy me a snack, honey. That's crazy, bro. If you want me to cook dinner, you better get me dinner. That's crazy, bro. Do I even participate in it? Like, if I get you the snack, do I get nothing? How the fuck are you going? How you need dinner before dinner? Big back as mm. fuck. Yo, get this. Get this smacking, dude. Get this smacking on my face. You gotta taste every last piece of rice. Mm. Mm. There we go. Okay. I, I can't do it. I just, that's it. That's it. That's it for me. I can't watch this anymore, dude. I'm sick of watching this woman, dude. She she actually makes me sick. It, she's just too much, man. Too much in, in every way. In every fucking way. This woman is just a diabolical down to the bone. But anyway, guys, you're not. You smell great today. Uh, thank you, everybody, for watching today's video. If you like today's video, I appreciate it. Everybody can leave a like, comment, subscribe, sharing the video. All those things I'd appreciate tremendously. Um, if you watch the video in its entirety and or you're here right now, leave it down below by typing in rice i guess dude because it's just something light you know rice is just something light something that's gonna hold me down for a little bit just something a little extra uh just something just gonna get me get me right that would just do me right you know what i'm talking about just some little something right now in my mouth like sound like a crackhead literally anyway you smell great i know i love i care for everything about you you smell really good today i like your eyebrows i like your hair i like your eardrums i like that you clean them out appropriately i like that you can hear everything and that's amazing i like your eyeballs too they really look the goodest i love that they're so marinated with so much liquidization because you hydrate yourself on a daily basis and that's amazing and i really appreciate that anyway guys if you want to check out my social medias it'll be listed down below Enjoy the rest of your day, guys. Peace.